Lady Louise Windsor reminds the Queen of Princess and as it was claimed the young royal wants to step up her duties when she becomes an adult, unearthed accounts show. Louise is set to turn 18 in November, meaning she will be faced with a series of huge life choices as she moves into adulthood. Among them will be whether she decides to take a royal title, and whether she opts to go to university as her next life step. The only daughter of Sophie Wessex and Prince Edward is widely reported to be the Queen's favourite grandchild, mainly due to her unique connection to Prince Philip. After the passing of the Duke of Edinburgh earlier this year, the 17-year-old has reportedly made a big impact on the monarch, as well as the likes of Kate, Duchess of Cambridge. Reports show that Louise has shown great patience with Kate's children and her cousins, as well as babysitting skills with Princess Charlotte. Although it is unclear exactly what steps Louise will make next, a source once claimed that as a result of her mature, diligent attitude, she could want to move into a more senior role within the firm. The source said that Louise's hardworking nature reminds the Queen of her daughter, Princess Anne, who is all about duty. And as she has watched her parents take on more responsibility during the coronavirus pandemic, and in the wake of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's split from the firm, Louise has been inspired to take on greater roles. The source continued, Apparently since Edward and Sophie have had to take on more since Harry and Meghan departed and Andrew was removed, their daughter has been inspired to step up and help alongside her parents. Another source reportedly noted how incredibly close the Queen was with Louise, adding, She is level-headed, thoughtful and kind, and reminds the Queen of herself as a young woman. They are thick as thieves and can often be found riding their ponies alone together, where the Queen enjoys imparting a lot of wisdom on her granddaughter. The source said Lady Louise is already getting media training and self-defense classes. They added, she has proved an enthusiastic and willing pupil. She is the sort of kid who can impress adults and get down on a child's level, all within the same space, which is perfect for someone who may be called upon to visit aged care homes or children's hospitals within hours of each other. It may not sound like much, but to have that ability, and patience, is rare. It's the kind of thing Meghan Markle wasn't prepared for. She thought she would attend gala dinners every other night, and be entertaining movie stars, but the reality of royal life is a lot more about ribbon cutting, and being visible to their subjects. Lady Louise was born into this life and has inherited a strong sense of duty from her parents, who the Queen finds blissfully reliable and diligent. Despite appearing to be ready for a more prominent role, Louise has enjoyed a relatively private upbringing with her brother James away from the media spotlight. Sophie reflected on their childhood during a Sunday Times interview last year, noting how they both go to a regular school. She added, they go to friends for sleepovers and parties. At weekends we do lots of dog walking and stay with friends. I guess not everyone's grandparents live in a castle, but where you are going is not the important part, or who they are. When they are with the Queen, she is their grandmother. Louise is beginning the second year of her A-levels, and is expected to follow in her parents' footsteps and work for a living after university if she goes 